New York began taking COVID vaccine appointments for those with comorbidities on Sunday, and as expected, it was a challenge to get one, which was something the state had warned of in advance due to high demand and limited supply. But it also showed that some of you are willing to travel if you have to to get the shot. As we hear now from Channel 2's Dave McKinley. After hearing that a lot of you who spent time on the computer dutifully refreshing the page in hopes of getting an appointment and finding out that ones at the state run clinic at UB were full up, we put out the question on social media if you were able to make an appointment outside of West of New York. Many of you responded that you had, and a good deal of those responses said you were able to find one in Rochester. Why that is, is a question we're trying to get an answer to. We do know, for example, that according to census data, there are about 32,000 more people who are over age 65 and eligible for the vaccine in Erie County than in Monroe County. With age comes an increased chance of comorbidity, so that could be compounding the demand in Erie County, where county officials say it appears that about a half Half million people or well over half of the county's population is now eligible. A number of these vaccine nomads though reported making appointments far beyond Rochester. Coming up next hour, we'll tell you where else they're heading. And then later on, we'll tell you that there may be other reasons at play, some you may not have thought of, as to why the vaccine may be more available in some regions of the state than in others. Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.